Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com. Today we're going to show you how to load a custom ROM on the T-Mobile MyTouch 4G slash HTC Glacier. Okay, before you begin this procedure, you must have done our how to temporary root your phone. You and click here to do that. Then our how to perm root S off your phone. And then you can come to this procedure and continue. Okay, so on the phone we're going to go to the market. search for ROM manager click on the free one and install it and wait for that to install okay once it's installed we're gonna click on it to open it click OK click OK and we're going to hit menu settings erase recovery hit back then flash clock work mod recovery click allow and wait for it to flash ok and then we're going to click reboot into recovery click ok and wait for it to do that Okay, and if you're presented with this screen, it means you have your custom recovery image. If you have a screen with like an exclamation point and a phone, uh, it means the recovery image didn't flash, so you need to go back into ROM Manager and hit flash recovery again, then reboot recovery again. You might have to do it a couple times for it to stick. But if you have this, you're all set. We're going to hit reboot system now and continue. Okay, now you can choose a ROM by going to our ROM section here and then choose your specific phone so my touch 4G and you have a list of ROMs right here we have the iced glacier ROM we're gonna click on that click the download link and then look for their latest version which you can decide unthemed or themed we'll go with themed click on that and download that to your computer okay now once the ROM is saved to your computer you're going to plug in your phone via USB and make sure that it's connected as disk drive and then delete that and then you're gonna take the ROM that you downloaded the dot zip do not unzip it leave it as a dot zip file and drag it over to the root of your SD card it means on the SD card itself like that not inside any folder so it's just your removable storage name and then the file is on there so wait for that to transfer okay now you're going to boot into recovery you can do that one way by going to ROM manager clicking reboot into recovery I know the ROM manager has install ROM from SD card I don't trust ROM manager in doing that so just do reboot into recovery and we'll do it manually which is what it's going to do anyway Okay, once it boots into recovery mode, the first thing you're going to do is back up your current ROM and wait for it to do that. It's going to take a while. Okay, once that's done, we're going to go to Wipe Data Factory Reset and wait for that to finish. Okay, so once it's done doing that, we're going to go to Install Zip from SD Card. Choose Zip from SD Card and we're going to look for the ROM that we put on here for me it's the iced glacier ROM so we're going to click that scroll down to yes and wait for it to install okay once it says install from SD card complete we can click power to go back and then reboot system now and wait for the phone to reboot okay when it boots up you'll be on your new custom ROM if you want to load a different custom ROM, simply go to our ROM section, find another ROM, put that ROM file on your SD card, boot into recovery, wipe data, and then flash that ROM. And you can do that as many times you want with as many different ROMs you want. Also, it's always a good idea to back up before you flash a ROM, just in case. There you go. Enjoy.